After that, you know, I'm trying to get these guys like Devin Haney. We want to checkmate him. You know, I'm the franchise world champion and the super world champion. You know what I mean? This guy, Devin Haney, he's faking it till he makes it. He's a true definition of a fake it till you make it with an email world title. I got these guys expose themselves at the end of the day. There's doubt in their heart and there's doubt in their mind. You know, Josh Taylor is trying to boost his ego and say that, hey, I'm undisputed and I work so hard. Good job for you. But you got to face guys like myself mm. to prove that. And I'm willing to step up to the plate. But are you? We'll see. Mm. Devin Haney, do you honestly think that you can get that made after, respectively, after both of your fights, should you both be successful? If I'm the franchise world champion, I can mandate any fight, right? Mm -hmm. For the WBC. So, Mauricio, we're going to make it happen. Okay. I know that's a fight. The so, fight look, this is how we're going to checkmate you, Devin. <laughs> I'm going to show you how we're going to checkmate you, you little bitch. We're going to checkmate you like this, all right? So, when you beat Lenaris, you got to beat him, all right? So, you got to beat him. Make sure you beat him. And then after that, we're going to mandate it. We're going to make you my mandatory. So then you can't leave, right? But if you want to overprice yourself, guess what? Oh, shit, plan B. We're going to put you in a purse bid. So then made the best network bid us right here. And we're going to make the fight happen. You can't run, my guy. You can't run. Don't run. <laughs> Those are the words of Teofimo Lopez once again as he tells Devin Haney, I'm going to make you my mandatory after that. Don't run. Now, <clears throat> Let me counterpunch. You know, we know the ongoing, the ongoing argument between Devin Haney and Teofimo Lopez, right? Hmm. And we also know that Devin Haney is the WBC super champion, right? Not the regular, but super. And the WBC franchise champion is Teofimo Lopez. And <clears throat> I like what Lopez said here because Lopez was like, hey, we're going to make you my mandatory. We can mandate, mandate any fight with the WBC. He's the WBC there. Let it be. So I, things w fall in the same lines how they should have anyway. OK, so <clears throat> I think whoever beat whoever won out of Lomachenko and, and Teofimo should have just fought Devin Haney and just called it, you know, quits. Then you would have a stray belt out there just lingering and someone else with a kingdom. And then the crowning themselves as a king that's saying, hey, I'm the king. See, until that until that day happens, until that showdown takes place. Excuse me. Devin Haney can say whatever he wants and he'll be in his rights. Why? Because he is the champion. He's the champion at 135. OK, until you beat that champion. There will always be another champion. Now, as far as as well as Josh Taylor, he mentions Josh Taylor, Taylor, but Josh Taylor don't have uh, uh, Teofimo Lopez problems. OK, he doesn't have those type of problems that Teofimo has. He doesn't have that argument. There's nobody out else at 140 saying, hey, I'm the champion. <clears throat> no one. No one's saying that. No one can say that. No one can claim that. They can call them out. They can fight themselves to some type of mandatory on all any four of those sanctioning bodies. But they cannot say like Devin Haney is saying, I'm the champ. Also with this weight class, it's not just Teofimo. It's me, too. So there you go. We need to fight to, to, for that to take place. OK, that's no different. That is no different. But there's the difference between Josh Taylor and Teofimo. But again, I like Teofimo and what he says. Hey, we're going to make we're going to mandate you. And hey, if you outbid yourself, we're going to take you to purse bids. Boom. No problem. It didn't happen with uh, Gamboso. So why not Devin Haney? Mm hmm. You know, but the only thing that kind of made me weary is when he said Mauricio Suleiman, because, you know, he's uh, he's not always the guy that gets things done. <laughs> OK, so that's one thing about that. And he says, fake it till you make it. OK, well, hey, he's faked it. So ac according to Teofimo, right? OK, well, he he should be, uh, obviously to him. He's made it. So let's make the fight. <laughs> right. So I would love to see that fight. He says he's going to checkmate Devin Haney. I think that is a very competitive fight between those two champions. You guys tell me what you think between of a fight or a potential fight between Teofimo Lopez and and Devin Haney. However, this is what I'll do. This is myself to conclude. Teofimo Lopez has said this. He has to make it happen. 
He has to make a viable attempt to make this happen now. Okay, that's that's what that means. I want the same energy after you beat Gambosos, and he claims he wants to knock Gambosos out in five minutes, four or five minutes, right? So um, I want to see him take on Devin Haney, his next opponent, before going to 140 and challenging Josh Taylor. But anyway, you guys tell me what you think about Teofimo Lopez's comments blasting Devin Haney, saying that he will checkmate him and make him fight. Tell me what you think. Please subscribe. And you guys been counterpunched.